Hi guys. Welcome to Port Dixon. <laughs> Tap into my kid heart. That was fun. <laughs> so some of you have asked why Jay and I are based out of Port Dixon and we are house sitting here. So we joined Trusted House Sitters at the beginning of the year or around the beginning of the year. And this is our second house sit. And we get to tour around this beautiful little beachy town and I want to take you guys along. So keep in mind during this video as you watch, Jay and I have only been in Port Dixon for a little over a week. So there are so many places to visit here in PD. I probably won't show nearly half of them in this video, but I'm gonna try my best. Lot of strip mall type areas in PD. You can also find there's a plethora of food options here. There's a Western obviously, but it's a lot of Indian, Malay, Chinese, Thai, Arabic, Turkey. If I missed one, leave it in the comments below. <laughs> but the choices are endless for food and all of these little shops, you just never know what you're gonna find. My favorite shop that we found so far that I've never been to anywhere else in the world is the Rainbow World. And it's kind of like a dollar store. You can get little odds and ends, especially when we are traveling. You never know if you're going to run out of something or need that one little item. Yes, when you're driving through PD, you will find lots and lots of strip mall type areas to stop in. There'll be restaurants, clothing, electronics, anything that you need is here. It's a great little beachy town. I love it. Now I keep calling PD a beachy town, which it is, but on the weekends, many people from KL will come here as like a little weekend getaway and they will bring their tents and pop up the tents on the beachfront. There's about 18 kilometers of beach and waterfront here in PD. So they have lots to choose from but it'll look like a tent city almost. It is pretty wild to see, but during the week, it's a little bit slower paced. And right now is, I believe it's a, the school holiday for a couple of weeks. So during the week here, it's still pretty busy. So it will slow down once we get closer to the end of September. But it is definitely vibing with all kinds of people. I'm just about to cross the street here. Yes, busy, busy, busy town for probably two weeks and then it'll get quiet again. All right, we are at Blue Lagoon. It looks very shallow here. There's a lot of families uh, playing in the water and I see people way out in the distance and they're only up to their knees. So this water must be very, very warm and that's why the kids must love it. You can it. also rent um, little shelters as well. They have chairs and shelters that you can rent. I saw a sign on one of the chairs that says five ring it. There's also a place that you can buy food. And yeah, people are just having fun, just uh, swimming around in the water. They also have banana boats that you can rent. So that would be fun to go out with your family. <laughs> have a laugh or two. Directly across. Oh. 
Oh, I thought she was waving at me. <laughs> I was like, hi, so friendly. <laughs> that was funny. I thought those little <laughs> kids were waving at me, but no, their mom was behind me <laughs> and they were waving at them. I just thought they were being really nice. <laughs> so directly across from Blue Lagoon is this beach here. And I really like this beach actually. You can see the Hibiscus Hotel just off in the distance. here is very fine it's brown but it's very fine it's very powdery beautiful sand and I just wonder if the waters here are deeper than the Blue Lagoon because there isn't a lot of families here Port Dixon is a oil and gas refinery town as well and on this beach you can see I'll just turn the camera here so in the background you can see the oil tankers just sitting out in the water they are massive. Wow, such a pretty beach. Oh, there's little shells. A beautiful waterfront area and it's so colorful down there all the buildings are painted different colors it is so pretty they have the big clock tower there and the Port Dixon sign you can rent bikes to drive up and down the uh, beachway there okay I was so excited to learn about these Baden Baden bundle stores because they're thrift stores my favorite kind of store I might end up doing a whole video just on this Baden Baden bundle. There are two in town. So that's my favorite store. So I'm, I might do a video on that, I think. Yeah, I think I might. Are definitely enjoying our time so far in Port Dixon. We are gonna be here until the middle of October so we still have lots of time to explore and as we do that and discover things we'll put them in the upcoming video so stay tuned for those. As I mentioned earlier Jay and I are doing a house sit through Trusted House Sitters so I'm gonna leave that link in the description below so go ahead and check that out if you're interested in doing any type of house sitting. Uh, that's one way Jay and I like to kind of keep on the budget. So thanks so much for coming along on the tour of Port Dixon. And as always, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button before you go. And we will see you on the next one, guys. Bye.